What's going on gangsters? My name is Luis Lewins and welcome back to another video. And today, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to put you on to a show that you've probably never heard of or you might have depending on how long you've been around YouTube. But this has to be one of the best creator like shows that I've ever seen. You know, like when a YouTuber or when like a group of YouTubers decide to like make a project. Well, there was a group of YouTubers called Rocket Jump that decided to make a series called VGHS. It stands for Video Game High School. Now, exactly what the name entails is exactly what the show's about, but the way they do it is so good, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna give you guys a little basic breakdown. I'm gonna just, like, tell you guys about the characters and stuff. And I'm gonna play, like, one or two clips from the first episode so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But VGHS follows a kid called Brian. But Brian is a gamer, ladies and gentlemen. He likes to play FPS shooters, and that's his thing, you know? So just like I love to play Call of Duty, just like I love to play Rainbow, he loves to play that type of shit too. Now in the show, it says that like being a gamer, going to that school is like one of the highest achievements. It's for video games, you know? You go to that school to prove that you're the best video game player out of the best. You know, they have like different classes. They have like a class for FPS. They have classes for like rhythm music, like Guitar Hero. They have classes for like racing games, like Forza and fucking like the little arcade machines so the show is just about brian trying to get into the school once he makes it into the school like a bunch of shit happens and the way that they like set up the school you know it really makes it feel like it could be a real thing because the heavy thing that they play into is a point system so once you join the school you're at a certain amount of points and it's like a leaderboard so let's say the school only allows like 30,000 students if you're 30,000 and one place on the leaderboard you get kicked out you know? so if you pass that threshold of being like the worst player in the school you're immediately expelled you know they have tournaments like they have drama bro like it's, it's a good ass fucking show like and it's made by youtubers it has good effects it has good acting and for me to say that I genuinely enjoy a show it like made by youtubers bro that's crazy but honestly ladies and gentlemen if you like gaming at all I would just say at least watch the first episode because the first episode is like it's perfect you know that shit hooks you in it shows you what the whole show is about in like one episode which i really love because nowadays bro you gotta watch like three four episodes of a show just to get a feel for it but no bro this came out in 2012 so this is 13 years old and it's still one of the best internet shows ever i'll leave the link to episode one down in the description if you really want to watch it but i would say watch it ladies and gentlemen i'm gonna be showing you guys like maybe two or three four maybe five clips you know as many as it takes to get through these 10 minutes without playing the whole 10 minutes but i just want to show you like the highlights of the first episode without showing you the whole first episode this first clip is going to be of our main character right here the one with like the blue i don't know if it's, this is his undershirt i don't know if this is boxers or what but the one with the blue right here his name is brian d and well he just got home from running late you know what i mean he has a tournament on like his fps shooter uh i think it's called like fire fire something you know it's like a knockoff call of duty but he has a tournament on that game and he's running late he was hauling ass on his bike and he just got home but uh oh he got home to some bullies ladies and gentlemen so let's check out bullies in vghs how's long way home brian d sweaty enough for you can we do this later k-pop i'm late for a clan match <laughs> What do you guys want already? Resources. It took me three weeks to grind for that stuff. And it took me three seconds. I guess that's what you call a strategy. GG Brian D. I love their fucking vibe, bro. The effects on this show are like really good. For 13 years ago, this shit is crazy. But there we go, ladies and gentlemen. That was the first clip I wanted to show you guys. So that is Bullies in VGHS. So that, that should tell you everything you need to know, bro. If Bullies look like that, bro, instead of stealing money, they're stealing fucking resources from a game. Like, if, th if that doesn't sound interesting, bro, I don't know, bro. I don't know. You're not a real gamer. The next clip I want to show you is from, like, their new segment called IRL, so in real life. And essentially, they're interviewing this guy right here. Now, this guy goes by the law. Like, literally the law. Now, he's supposed to be, like, the best player for the FPS shooter. He's, like, the best player in the world, I guess. So, he's all over TV. He's all over the news. I'm going to introduce you guys to the law real quick. And then I'm going to show you a clip with Brian D and the law. And they come together. Not, not in the way that you guys think. Because you guys are weird as fuck. But, no. You guys are going to see. You guys are going to see. Looks 
like we got ourselves a server. So since he is the best player, ladies and gentlemen, every time he loads up into a game, it says The law has entered the game. So that's how you know that motherfucker's serious. Alright, I'm gonna show you guys two more clips. And this next one takes place after Brian D got robbed. You know, he got robbed from all his resources by those goons on the flying bike. This is him getting home and rushing to his computer, you know? We've all done this shit, bro. Whether it be for a fucking Fortnite event, or whether it be because you just want to hop on so bad, or whether it be because your friends are about to hop on, like, a ranked match and you want to hop in before you had to wait a whole fucking 45 minutes. We've all done this shit, bro. We've all gotten home and ran straight to our fucking setup. Hey, mom, even the mom's a gamer, bro. <laughs> That's called Field of Fire. You know, so his mom pressed him, he said take the cat outside, and bro, that shit happens all the time, bro. Every time conveniently, whether I be in a 1v1 for like the dub in Fortnite, or whether I'm in a fucking 3v4 in Rainbow, it's bro, my mom tells me to do something right in like the peak of whatever I'm doing. You know, bro, so this show is good because it's literally made by people that play video games. You know, it's made by people that go through all the shit that we go through. All right, but now I can show you guys the interaction between Brian D and the law. So you guys got to remember Brian D is AFK and the law is not, you know, so the law found him and he's going to have some fun. You know, he's the best player in the game. He, he joined the lobby to pub stomp. He found the AFK guy. So let's see what let's see what's going on. And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, this hot fucking eating Brian D motherfucker killed the law. The best player in the game. You know, after this, he gets an invitation to go to the school. He ends up making like a friend group with different people, like in different majors. You know, one of them is like a, he, she's designing a video game. One of them is like a drift, a major. And well, he's an FPS major. You know what I mean? Like he falls in love with an another FPS major. But it's, it's a really good fucking show, bro. Like I usually fucking shit on shows. You know, I usually say, oh, the acting is so bad. The music is so bad. The camera work is so bad. Like this is so boring. But you guys gotta check out this show for sure, bro. Like I said, the link is gonna be in the description below. That's pretty much it for me, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys watch this show, and I hope you guys have a good night. That's pretty much it for me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.